Communication Boards Using Google by Jennifer Mitchell, Speech Language Pathologist. You can make a communication board for children who are nonverbal or minimally verbal using either Google Documents or Google Presentation. Your board will be available to edit any time on any device. You can also make it public for others to use online. It only takes 5 to 10 minutes or even less. This presentation includes step-by-step -step directions using Google Presentation to create a communication board for core vocabulary. If you have a Google Gmail account, then you automatically have an account on Google Drive. If you haven't used it, then go to docs.google.com and log in using your Gmail account. Once you are in your Google Drive, select Create, and in the drop-down, select Presentation. A new browser tab will open with your document. Select Untitled Presentation at the top left corner and rename your presentation. Don't worry about saving anything. Google automatically saves everything for you. I usually start with a blank slide. So to change the slide layout, select Layout on the toolbar and click on Blank. I also like to keep my board organized. So I place a table on the slide by selecting Table on the toolbar. Move your cursor across the cells to add the number of rows and columns you want. To resize your table, select a corner and drag it to the size you need. Now you are ready to put pictures in the table. This is my favorite part because it is quick and easy. Google will allow us to find images in the Google search, then drag and place them into a cell without leaving the slide. To open the search, go to the toolbar and select Tools, then select Research. Once the research box is open on the right side of the presentation, click on the inverted triangle in the drop-down and select Images. Type a keyword in the search box and press enter. You can scroll down to view more pictures. Of course, if you plan on selling your communication board, you should only select copyright free images using the filter. When you have decided on an image that you would like to use, select the image then drag and place it into the table cell. You can change the size of the image by selecting a corner and dragging. This is a good time to decide if you want to remove the hyperlink. To remove the hyperlink, select the image, then click on Remove. Continue finding pictures for your board until you have it completed. To share it with others, just select the Share button in the top right corner and change the settings. To see this communication online, select the Google hyperlink. And if you want your own copy to edit, when you have this file open, just go to File and select Make a Copy, and you will find it in your own Google Drive.